aufquetschen. Redox word is combination of two words. Red plus ox. Red means reduction and ox means oxidation. What is reduction now? Reduction is gain of hydrogen, loss of oxygen or gain of electrons. Here we can have three concepts. If there is gain of hydrogen, loss of oxygen or gain of electrons, the reaction is termed as reduction reaction. And what is oxidation? It is just reverse of reduction. It is loss of hydrogen, gain of oxygen, loss of electrons. Gain of oxygen is oxidation and loss of oxygen is reduction. Now we can move to an example. We can have copper turnings. We can take copper metal turnings and heat it in presence of oxygen. When you will burn it in presence of oxygen, reddish brown color of copper will turn to black. You will get copper oxide. What you can call this reaction is? It is oxidation of copper. If you are doing reverse of this, copper oxide is heated in presence of hydrogen and it is turning to copper plus H2O. Now copper oxide is losing oxygen. So loss of oxygen is termed as reduction. So these are reverse reactions of each other. But we can see that reduction and oxidation takes place simultaneously. How? If you are taking copper sulfate and reacting it with zinc, it turns to zinc sulfate plus copper. Where you have done this reaction? Remind it. Yes, it was displacement reaction. So what happens here? You can see. Copper metal is here in the oxidation state of plus 2. You know sulfate ion. This molecule is having charge minus 2. So sulfate ion is having charge minus 2. Copper is having charge plus 2. Zinc metal is here in oxidation state 0. Any metal which is not in combined form, in elemental form, it is taken as 0. Zinc here is zinc 2 positive as sulfate here is 2 negative. Copper metal here in elemental form is taken as 0. You can see now copper 2 positive after gain of 2 electrons turns to copper. What is this termed as? This is gain of gain of electrons. Gain of electrons means here is reduction of copper taking place. See this, zinc is turning to zinc 2 positive. Zinc metal is turning to zinc 2 positive after loss of 2 electrons. Zinc is losing electron. Loss of electron is termed as oxidation. So, dear kids, what we can see that reduction and oxidation takes place simultaneously. If one substance is losing electrons, other is gaining electrons. If one is losing oxygen, other is gaining oxygen. One is losing hydrogen, another is gaining hydrogen. So both will take place simultaneously and it is termed as redox. Redox means reduction and oxidation taking place simultaneously. One more example, we can have manganese oxide. It reacts with HCl to form manganese chloride plus chlorine plus water. 
Now you have to see manganese oxide. See this manganese oxide and HCl. Which substance is losing hydrogen, which is gaining hydrogen? So it would be tough in terms of gain and loss of hydrogen and oxygen. We will do it in the terms of electron concept. We know chlorine minus 1, hydrogen plus 1. Here chlorine is in zero oxidation state. In water, hydrogen always plus 1, oxygen minus 2. So chlorine as we know has oxidation state minus 1. So 2 atoms of chlorine minus 2. So manganese plus 2. Oxygen is having oxidation number minus 2. Minus 2 into 2 minus 4. So manganese plus 4. Now you can see that manganese from plus 4 oxidation state turns to manganese plus 2 oxidation state. What I can say? Magnese plus 4 oxidation state after gain of 2 electrons turns to magnese plus 2 oxidation state. Gain of electron means reduction of magnese is taking place. And chlorine from minus 1 oxidation state to 0 oxidation state. This is loss of electron. That means chlorine is getting oxidized. So what you can see here that one substance is getting reduced, another is getting oxidized. Now we have one more thing to discuss. That is concept of reducing and oxidizing agent. See if I am saying in this reaction, magnesium is getting reduced from manganese plus 4 oxidation state to plus 2 oxidation state. That means it is gaining 2 electrons. If it is gaining 2 electrons, it is helping other substance to lose electron. That means it is helping the other substance to get oxidized. So the substance which is getting reduced is called as oxidizing agent. The reducing agent. Reducing agent is a substance which help in reduction of other. Reduction of manganese oxide is done by HCl. It is called as reducing agent.